Oh my gosh, I'm too... Hello. <laughs> that is what happens when you're too busy looking back at the camera. Can you believe that? And I'm just talking about... Maybe I did see it, Craig, down the road. And that's what I was looking at. Alice, are we still live? <laughs> I'm in shock. Oh my goodness. Hang on, I have to call this in. I have to call Aubrey because they desperately and... They're desperately looking for cats. So, how crazy is that? I think that's exactly what I saw. I thought I imagined this lion. Like I said to you, no, no, I've got to use two hands. Well, it's one of the Birmingham boys. Right, I need to jump on the radio. One, Dodengala, Buyatela Access, approaching Gari Gate. One on lock. How crazy is that? I said that I thought it saw, and then I'm telling you about how they, if you want to spot animals, spot chameleons, you've got to look at the camera, and here's me nah, 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 talking away, and Craig's going, Lion, Lion Taylor, Lion, and I didn't even realize that there was a lion five meters from me. So it just shows you <laughs> how crazy is that? Craigie, should we do my normal maneuver? Let's go in front. Uh, whee, hold on Craig, that was a term I might. Uh, that's affirmative. Um, you're welcome to make your approach. Just come straight for your tele access. I'm gonna go radio down now. Just trying to get in front of him quickly. Hold on Craig again. So there's lots of, I think the warthogs have been in here. We have to do our sneaky maneuver where we get in front of him and then we, and then we reverse. So we look at him. Wait. Oh, be a hole, please. Okay, I think we've got enough room now to do it. Sorry, Craig. Yeah, you're right. You're still on. Didn't drop you. Okay, here we go. Now we need to figure out who we've got. That's crazy. And I'm actually gonna. Woo! Linda, you said the cat today is saved. It is indeed. How lucky are we? I'm gonna, who is this lion? He's very beautiful. I wonder if it's not Mfumo. He's going to mark now like, up against the tree. That is unbelievable. I cannot believe. See, I need to trust myself sometimes. And when I, when I think that I imagine objects in the very far distance, and I must go to myself, tell it, maybe it is. I need to give myself more credit sometimes. <laughs> I'm so good at spotting things. Okay, right, now he's going through a very thick block. I need to just quickly also update on the radio. This Madodo and Gala has now changed direction. He's going north. He's cutting through the block from Vuyatela Access, sort of um, uh, back towards the warden's houses, towards uh, Sydney's dam. I'm going to try and stick with him through the block, but it's very thick. Okay, let's go and let's try to go around. I don't know if I'm going to be able to navigate through that block. I think, can anybody help me? I'm so flustered that a, a lion was giving me a death stare because I didn't realize that he was even right next to the car. I think it is, um, is it not Nana? Mm, Ladybug and Daisy, you think it, it's Tinyo? Mm, I don't know. I, didn't, I actually haven't had a proper look. I'm, I'm too distracted. I'm trying to find a way in here now what a nightmare this block is we're going to definitely break the car if we try and go through here i'm gonna to have to try and uh, stick on there's a beautiful big game pathway here so we're gonna to have to use these networks these road networks that the animals have created so please bear with me i apologize if it feels as though i'm not paying your attention i just don't want to end up stranded connor's not here to come and be the rescuer he was coming this way I think he's going straight towards Sydney's dam. <laughs> Craig, can you believe our luck tonight? That's so funny. It's amazing how things like this happen. I'm going to try and guess where he's going to come out because I can't actually see anything. No, we, we'll have to have a look. I, I honestly, like I said, I was too flabbergasted by this whole thing to honestly even try and figure out which lion it is. He did have a little cut underneath his eye and that looks 
like exactly the same thing that we saw the other day. There he is. Oh, Taylor, you biscuit. If today was going to be the day that I was going to be on form, thank goodness. Okay, he's just going through there again. You can just see him moving. <laughs> oh, that's so funny. So a couple of you are saying that you've never seen me so flustered before and Craig was so, so calm. That is funny, isn't it? Oh my goodness, Craig. Hold on. Oh. No, that's not going to work. Now I'm stuck. Alice, I'm stuck. Well, we can look at the lion. It will get unstuck, but we're going to have to do a bit of maneuvering. There he goes. He's walking through the bush. He's going straight to... Straight to Sydney's dam by the looks of it. This is why I didn't want to come in yet, because I knew I was going to get myself into the situation. But he's about to disappear. Um, Alice, I'm, yeah, I'm going to have to ask her, can we go to Tristan, please? <laughs> so I can try and get myself out of the situation while this lion disappears. Fortunately, I'm not going to be able to do it live this time. I might even have to, even have to engage Diflock now. Alice, can you hear me? Right, I'm going to send you across to Tristan now. Apparently he's racing off to a leopard, so let's go and see if he's managed to find it.